Ben Thompson. Ready. Ready to fight. All right, so we got two classically trained strikers here. Any chance this fight actually goes to the ground? This fight does not go to the ground. This one will be fought in the pocket. Two guys will stand in front of each other. They will trade punches. They will trade kicks. It's going to be a classic matchup that you normally see inside of a ring. We get it in the octagon tonight. Oh, beautiful work on the feet there by Gainbred. Was that the three-piece in a soda, DC? He has a commitment to kick it tonight, and it shows. Trying to establish that jab once again. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this jump. Wonder Boy gets caught with that punch. His chin is held up thus far. Got to shore up the defense here, though. I mean, he's cutting down the side with these beautiful leg kicks. Look at how he drives his knee right into his opponent's midsection. Three minutes to go. Thompson gets touched by that kick there. Good kicks there by Jorge Gamebred Masvidal. Beautiful technique on the straight right hand. How's his opponent still standing? I mean, I have no idea. This fight is supposed to be over. And it might not be over now, but it's going to be over very soon. Big body. Big knee to the body. So just over 20 total strikes have found the mark for Jorge Gamebred Masvidal. Big ball punch lands. Now he gets back to range. Thompson gets absolutely punished by that head kick. Big leg kick lands. 90 seconds and counting here in our opening round. Look at him working at trying to shut the liver down. No. His leg is hurt here, kick a little bit. Well, the leg kicks have been a big storyline in this one, and there's another one. So he continues to slow his opponent down, and nice poker face on the other side. I'm not sure how many more he can take. He won't be able to take many more. Think about Edson Barbosa, how he lands those beautiful leg kicks, no wind-up, so fast. Eventually, guys get stopped from taking too many. This seems to be the path that he is wanting to take tonight in this fight. Oh, and he caught the kick. He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. Throwing that jab now again, the fighter of eights. Wonder Boy gets caught with that punch. Don't be afraid to get that head off the center line. Certainly the big storyline in that previous round. DC, take us through the replay. He did a fantastic job of finding his spots. He was sneaking that kick right up under the elbow and landing those nasty body kicks. He did a great job of recognizing a weakness in his opponent's game and really taking advantage of it. Ready, fight. Ready. Round two here. Big shot lands. Oh, Masvidal in a real flow here, sticking and moving. Crowd is like just reacting every time he moves. Masvidal now has the crowd eating out of his hands. The one thing about Jorge that makes him so difficult to deal with is he never allows him to trap him. You think you got him trapped to try to hit the four takedowns? He evades and escapes. He's a phenomenal fighter. 48 total strikes have now landed for Jorge Masvidal. And landing at a 49% clip tonight thus far against Steven Thompson. Oh, he lands a knee to the body now, DC. Talk to us about that strike. They suck so bad, especially when you're going forward. You walk his feet to the body. It could in the 
really limit the mobility of your opponent with those legs. Back and forth we go here. Well, he's been pretty accurate tonight. He's landed some significant strikes, but his corner's looking for him to mix it up a little bit more and just throw more volume. Because they don't see too much of a threat. This guy has to have confidence in knowing that when he extends his combinations, he's still safe, but he's also going to be able to land. He's got to be finding that confidence in his mind that all the reps in the training room are going to pay off. Beautiful body to land right under the elbow. Effective use of the jab by Thompson. Just over two minutes to go in round two. Oh! Unbelievable. Lands a strike now from the bottom. Nice work there by Wonderboy Thompson. All right, so inside the open guard of his opponent. You gotta be careful playing around for too long here on the ground with this guy. All right, so he postures up here and now figures to rain down some ground strikes. Yeah, the ground and pound will be a plenty from this position. Oh, look at him jumping in to try to get the finish. All right, so pretty good damage here with the ground and pound. Nothing superficial about these strikes. They are intending to harm. Oh, yeah, he's landing very accurately, and he's landing to get damage off. All right, he's very comfortable fighting off his back, DC. Now looks like he's trying to hip escape. Yeah, he's trying to hip escape or maybe look for a Kimura here. Strong bottom work here, staying busy. Thompson's lower jaw now starting to show signs of swelling. Well, as usual, suffocating work from the top here by Jorge Gamebred Oscar. Unbelievable! That'll do it! He got it! Wow, so how about that? Just before the end of the round, he lands an absolutely huge shot to drop his opponent. The referee wisely jumps in furiously to stop the fight. How about it? He catches the other guy just at the end of the round. Maybe his opponent was looking forward to the storm of the next round. Now he won't see it. What a result here tonight. All right, Bruce Buffer is in there with the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called a stop to this contest at four minutes, 52 seconds of round number two. To play the winner by